position to still be very aggro. Obviously, Shazam's going to look to play the uh, Sova here. So that works out. And they push in. Left. We're going to see that Moose is the first one. He'll be a bit of a sentry with low HP as long as he can get that initiator dart in. It's good to go. The curveball to answer. Shots from Sick and doing what he does best, opening it up for the team to have a bit easier of a chance to get in here. 3v2, Moose is low and Stellar at full health. Here comes the Molly. Oh, the is good. That just buys him so much time, and then Sick goes in. He gets a beautiful 3k yep. to secure the round for Sentinels. The Cerebral team likes to figure out what kind of precedent is being set by their opponents. Here, tens being tens, that's expected already. But you can see where they're playing, how they're rotating a little bit, or how fast they're rotating. Is a proto comes up huge on the cipher, taking off heads as he makes his way into B here. 50 seconds left in the round the 4v3 and luminosity making it very possible here to grab the second round of the half or the first yeah. half and look at what stellar just did stellar just paranoia is out and you see both members that weren't there for sentinel start to rotate over because they think the hits on b at the same time dre's already oh hightailed it the heck out of there moose is all the way back behind enemy lines they have full control left. of the site they're gonna oh get that spike down and if a proto continues to cause problems it's gonna be devastating for Sentinels, two members left. Zom's in the newest edition, Tense. Rolling through together. They got blind and smoke for this one. Oh, he holds it. Not enough classic with cheese. We have to see a very different look here. A paradigm shift in how they play. Pushing out. They will be aggressive. Coming out with some specters and classics. The Vandal firing from the top of mid here for Zeus. He picks up a few. A heal coming in now is that overheal procs off and they're going to be looking towards tiles to possibly finish this one off tens patiently waiting and you'll see the family photo waiting for him on cat they take a picture thief with the four it was used on the other side on a looks like they still have quite a bit of utility to be used here dog they're going to try to get in here it goes roomba's out Roomba's out, the dart's gonna follow, and the paint shells as well. You see the paranoia not gonna connect on to anyone. His sick has been left absolutely unscathed and unchecked around this corner. Now they start to funnel in. Sick again on that lane. Looking to see if he can spot anyone. It's actually Dapper who gets the first one. Shazam from back in Bo's house looking for a little bit of action. As sick gets another one. Tens continuing to light things up. A Position. Have a couple of ultimates here, and that Ooh. opening pick onto tens there is just beautiful. And Dre piles it on as well. Two members of Sentinels already off the board. Sick kind of has to go aggressively here to try to push things back. He gets one in trade and then backs up. But with that, Luminosity have control of A. They go right for tens this time, playing off possibly that set precedence of aggression. Yeah, we're going to get a peek here. Let's peek from top and bottom, even if they get the smoke out. I like the forward utility. Giving Sick and the rest of the team a little bit of trouble as they try to get in for this. Shazam! Gonna try to do what he can here. Maybe he saves at this point. He knows he's gonna start having a flank on him, so he may have to commit to what's in front of him for the time being. It's gonna be a quick one for one there. And uh round, they can consecutively get through what will be the buy rounds here for Sentinels and put him back on Eco. There's a showstopper coming in. Boy, Dre, looking to get a little bit deeper. Fires it to the back of Boathouse. Oh, Won't get the wow. kill. Sentinels doing a beautiful job of holding off LG as they try to get into the B site. I mean, things went absolutely sideways. That showstopper should have gotten more effect out of it. And then the, the control that should have come from that should have opened things up Squeaks for LG considerably. But again, just narrowly going sideways. But Stellar's still in a very winnable situation here. It's not easy by any means, but it's certainly doable. Yeah, I mean, he's facing less than 100 HP, so we'll see what he can do. He's got 33 himself, so it's going to be tough. I think he actually stopped the footstep just before he needed to, but oh, no. maybe the timing's there. Doesn't pull the trigger. Zon Fury for Moose is going to be used trying to tag up Dapper, knock him down, and that's exactly what he does. Tens, who was close by, also very quickly getting involved. The counter, oh no. Thief, Thief got behind enemy lines. He was able to take care of tens, but then Sick does the same to him. Zombs with three. There's just one member left on the side of Luminosity and it's Moose. He's got to go fast. I don't know that he's got enough time and then he's sandwiched in as well. The kill is going to come through. The time doesn't matter. A 4k for Zom. Sentinels take the lead. Keeping Dapper out to the side. Oh, he's smart to keep that flank. Whoa. Oh, Super yep. close there as the bot gets dismantled right before going off. Moose takes down tens. To start us off here, after your boy Dre goes down to eight. Great paranoia from Zombs to buy some more time. If you're Luminosity, you kind of have to go here. You don't really have enough time to flip the map. And Sentinels gladly oh. welcomes them with open arms. It's a bloodbath. Every so, every so often, will they get... 
I, I love the way the Sentinels is playing here. Will oh. they peek? Will they not? Luminosity always trying to find a bit with each location they get, but it's not until the site do they find that defense. Yeah, and at this point, I mean, the teammates have arrived. It's going to be a straight-up 3v3 here. Bladestorm's involved, but you got to keep an eye on Moose. If Moose can stay alive, that Hunter's Fury really could secure them the round. Thief slowly making his way forward. Gets the best of 10s. Another filthy shot as he takes Stick out as well. Shazam getting the best of him into a 1v2. Shazam... Historically very good in situations like this. Good for one, but a proto. These sort of defensive shenanigans. But once again, we're seeing this run it back. Taking so much space. Sick. Get the kill, too. Gosh, that's beautiful. He thought he could play him off while wow. hitting the wide angle, too. Looks like they're going to be hitting a dog. They are. There's from the shadows. Getting info, and he's going to get behind them, too. You've got to be careful, but I guess it doesn't really matter if Sentinels can hold it down themselves on the site. Forget the reinforcements, but Dre with the showstopper that we talked about. Stay here, Riff. Oh, boy. Close play by Dre for hearing so many footsteps. Kind of puts himself right there in the frying pan. Moose, though, makes up for it with a twofer, and Tens is going to answer back. A nice overheal from Thief. He's going to be loving that as he waits for the rest of the team. You have the Cypher Cam to come in if that's on cooldown. And maybe a Paranoia to be used here. No, actually, just another smoke to come out. That Dark Shroud on top. <laughs> paranoia did get thrown out as soon as I looked down to see his util. And now they're in here for the defuse. Just wide right, looking to the left. Doesn't have enough. And it's going to be Stellar that comes through. A little classic with cheese onto Shazam there. And uh, what a round. Positioning from Thief. Utility to push Sentinels back. Let Thief get into a cheeky spot and potentially blow things up. Good for one. Great trade from Dens. They get the Bulldog out. Not going to need that. And no ultimate's really on deck either. So everything's about utility and who can make the shots. Smoke and dash in as they try to create space in A. Tens makes that happen as Dre goes down. Zoms just on the other side playing cat and mouse there with Stellar. Nobody's going to peek the smoke right away. Spike's going to go down in A. Another retake here coming in from LG. Now this one tested with full-on rifles for both teams. And uh, most of it's coming from... From Tree here. Let's see how they take it. And Riv, I, I want to draw attention to this because this is where Luminosity really had their glow up. Right at the beginning of the year, it was in their ability to take specifically against Sentinels. But now that Tens is in the fold, I don't know that you're going to oh. be nearly as effective as you were before the Ace is stolen. Yeah. Tagged up. He understands that a camera's there. They have a really good idea of where the hit's going to be, given where the middle of the map was. The Paranoia is going to come out onto the side as it looks like they're all drawing their attention over towards B. You've got the Reina playing the middle of the map just to be safe, but Stellar's left unchecked. He shoots a couple right in the back of the head. Tens dashing around. Not going to matter. Moose gets him. Dre gets onto it as well as he's looking to take the last member of Sentinels off the site. It's Shazam in a 1v3. Well, is that a 1v2? No longer going to be around Thief. And everyone pushing forward could signal another quick one. As we have a few phantoms here for the side of Sentinels on that D, or on the attack side. And they're going to go in with the Blade Storm as well. Yep, the paranoia from Seller was there as well, and a couple of shots from the Bulldog secure the kill onto Tens. Blade Storm no longer in effect, but Sentinels have control of the site. Zom should be able to get the spike down. Members of Luminosity have now started to arrive. This is again the spot where they shine in retakes in a one in a in a disadvantageous situation as far yep. as personnel goes. What can they do? Kind of util will help them get in. They just have so many more angles to check when you don't have the numbers here, but they're going to try. Oh. Going to try. Even with that Emperor Zom, Zom finds two again. Tried and true coming out of him if anybody's trying. Eh, that's amazing to see. That says a lot about who he is, how he plays, and, and what situations he can play in. Oh. All right, here we go. Sick using the run it back. And it looks like, yeah, it's, it's a fake. Riv, it's a bloody fake. They used the right back. They used it from the shadows as well to think that the hit's going on A. And they're biting onto the bait. You see him start to pull off B is entirely open. Sentinels have gotten on there for free. And they've been able to take aggressive positioning to stop the rotations, to stop the cutoffs. The one problem is that Six on the other side of the map, he is going to have to get on his high horse, scurry over to make it to get a chance to have an impact on the play. The spike is down. Shazam waiting just on the other side. He's got great... 
information if he can just be patient. No, but <gasps> Moose gives him the business. Oh my Dapper god. drops as well, and now it's Sick, who was late to the show Not in a 1v3. It's a winnable one. He's good for one, but Dre stops it. He's going to get the defuse as well. Sentinel showed something spicy and luminosity. Hold it off just fine. explosions. That... Right. Hanging in a tree, but if their attention's elsewhere, they're gonna get caught. Looking around, Zom's good for one already. He's watching that tree area, this has a nice flank. The team's made it fully into the site. Flame walls up, and they can just hang out now and allow this to tick down. So it's now for LG to regroup. Here comes Dart going in. Nice. One underneath, they're able to find tens. That's kind of a mistake there that he misses it coming in. What will happen as LG comes through? Where are they stronger? Sick and Shazam able to trade two, and it's not going to be enough so far from LG. A Proto and Stellar oh. doing their best as they are the last two. Last oh. It is. Look at that. Uh, all the way, you got a triple double there on Shazam. Looking pretty nice. You always love to see that. Uh, and the rest of the team, uh, I, I, like I said, I was coming. He's he's playing as a jet should, and I kind of referenced that earlier. You know what a jet needs oh. to do in tens. Is, Maybe one of the best out there. So, yeah, let him roll on that spot. And you're right. Everybody's playing well across the board with that confidence coming into the team, even with the swap before Master is here. Spikes planted. Dapper toying in here. Cypher diff. Cypher diff. Toying. Oh, no, bro. He did Come it to on. him. He did it to him. That's all right. Now they're in A. Let's see what happens. Yeah, two members left for Luminosity to try to keep the map alive, and so far, Dre and Moose get a couple. Dre gets another one. A 1v2 Moose left alone. He's got a Sheriff. Surely, he doesn't stick. The Diffuse gets it to half. He's got a chance here, playing a little ring around the Rosie, and it's not... ...and picks like this. I always read the wrong ones. <laughs> it's plaguing me. Oh, oh uh -oh. push to it. No kills. I don't know how that didn't go through yet. Thief with the fucking on the backside. They're not looking, though, and he almost picks another pocket. That's going to be Tens getting himself in with the rest of the team. Dapper and the squad is now feeling pretty good about the situation as they back up. They feel like they may have them on a scramble. And Stellar is right there to tell him, nah, we are not on the back foot. It is a 3v3 and they're prepared to keep defending. Riv, that pinch was nasty. The paranoia comes out from Dre across ramps. Thief comes in with the backside with the buck. He blows him up. That was absolutely beautiful. But now, as you mentioned, we're down to this 3v3. Stellar, certainly worse for wear. Only has 9 armor Spike and planted. 80 health to work with. The spike is going to go down. You see Sentinel start to assume some post plants. Really good position here from Zoms. And the thing is here for, for Luminosity, they're going to have to deal... Yeah, that... Zoms can be a serious problem here. He's already put, he's already put out the paranoia. Great wall there as well. Very few options for entry here. If you're looking yep. Asuki, they're going to have to go. The discipline box has to be checked. It does get checked, but not before one drop. Sick comes up with two. Sentinels get to four. All right, nades through, nades over. They're trying to play off. Maybe Luminosity's getting early info, and they go straight brazen for the old point. A third trade. This is going to come in with the classic. Yes, Dog. Tens finds it. He knows exactly how much damage he did, how much he peppered Stellar, and throws a few more 9 millimeters his way. There it is with the peek around your boy, Dre, <laughs> getting lucky with that. Bucky with a quick slug shot. Shazam makes quick work of that trade. And a round that easily should be going to Sentinels. They've lost two. Let's see if Thief can do a little more eco damage here before he, he gets uh, taken down, if that happens. And, you know, for, for Thief, you could... Or just take yeah. it off line like that, right? That obviously helps. Shazam takes care of them. Thief drops. Sentinels are going to win the round. But one of the things I was going to say was... And tens, if Tens can continue to draw attention over by A, maybe pull some of the members back. But at this point, there is no, there are no secrets. The bail has been lifted. They know they're going to be Dre. Good for spike one. Down, He's going to drop the hands of Shazam. But the spike goes down as well. 13 seconds left on the clock. They should be able to get the spike down with relative ease. And now they're going to assume their post plants. Again, keep an eye on Tens on the other side of the map. He has a showstopper. He can yeah. really blow this thing up. And the wall's there to, oh, that's big. Moose is back online. Ooh. Tens gets one. one. Goes for the pre-fire. Knows there's going to be a few there on the other side. Hits the first shot. Expecting a second. Up over the shoulder is going to be the paint shells. But it's not enough to, to kill, uh, get the kill on Stellar, rather. 
And he's forced to save. Yeah, there's a heal there, but it's not going to be enough time. They also need to recoup a few of these rounds. And you mentioned Tens being off on the side, Doug. That happened as everybody on Sentinels was at Aura every time that he plays. Shazam here with the Blade Storm. LG! LG! Like like now this. trying to be the first one to get that aggression in mid. What Sentinels love so much. At least get to the top of the stairs and start reading the map. LG tries to put their foot forward here. Loses three immediately on the round for just a Zom's Nation. Feels like a lot more. Uh, see what happens here as they continue to play slowly. And nobody else today has pushed up. It's all going to be the work of a proto now. I mean, they're coming to him. Does he have what it takes? Uh, I think here we, we, we saw this on Ascent, right, where a Luminosity and a pistol dial up something special. Yep. Uh, and it just hasn't... It's just, it's just It's been close, right? Again, they, they've played on Knife's Edge. They've been just, just on the precipice of doing something absolutely insane, but it just hasn't panned out for Luminosity here. We see first map go Sentinel's way, this second map, second map, excuse me. Uh, certainly seeming to follow suit yep. as Sentinel's take us. When you're down 7-1 plays like that need to be made. You can't sit back. You can't just say, we'll play the longer corner, or the off angle, and hope they come to us. Good moves by Luminosity to start making uh, Sentinel's play a little sweaty on this one. Changing up the strat. It seems like the audible goes towards A through Vents here. That's known. The pinch from both sides, and LG has read this like a book here coming into it on Sniffer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of bad smells out there. <laughs> Zom's, Zom's using the From the Shadows to get behind oh enemy lines, word. but Luminosity once again handle it just fine. A proto shot seems to have come online, and it could not have come at a better moment. Sentinels down to two members left. That wall's gonna go up. A proto rips another one down from the skies as Ray and the rest of Luminosity get a flawless round. Seeing again some of that impact. No rifles. Tens just one point away from the showstopper, but it looks like they aren't even gonna play around that. The spike is down, but they've taken this area of the map for now. Yeah, the blind and dash oh, up top. Oh, wow, dude. Proto with a one tap. You have to watch out for this guy all the time. Oh, <laughs> gross. <laughs> Again, not watching out for this guy. A Proto comes up with another one. Dapper's going to try to do the same. Cypher Diff's coming up big here, but he gets dropped by Moose from a quick clothesline coming out of B stairs. And what do they do to rectify this situation? This could still be jumped over. They're going to try and get him back in the game. Nice wall to block off that uh, possible takedown on the res. But this one has started off quick, and Luminosity's aim is coming online. Hey, a proto's just been clicking, man, and this is what we've wanted. This is what we've been waiting for this entire series. They're at a numbers advantage here. The thing is, as Sick and Zoms, they're healthy. Right? They're health well, not healthy anymore. Sick drops. Zoms trades out a proto, though. 2v3. But Moose, good for three, not able to get the fourth. Zom's left. taps on the plant. He's only got eight seconds. There's not really a, a lot of time for mind games. You kind of have to commit to it here. See Luminosity pushing in from a couple of different angles. Zom's telly's out for the post plants and Dre's crispy clean shots secure the round for Luminosity again. I believe Rip. But again, Thief, members of Luminosity starting to gather on the defensive side. Keep a close eye on Dapper here. Look at how much. Look at the work. Man, he's going for the scenic route. It's a long con as he's going to get try to get all the way behind after getting through B. But you've got to wonder if by the time he makes it onto the onto the play, if it's going to be over. Luminosity taking different angles. The proto drops first. But the, the, the delay is there. The paranoia is going to come out. That should be the green light. That should be the sign to go. Thief the first one in. Sick handles him just fine. Stellar drops as well. Dapper showed up and he got the last kill. The long con pays off just fine. Sentinels. They were bleeding. They stopped. They were able to fight back just fine. Drops things down to a 2v2. Thief's frenzy gives Shazam the fits. And it's all up to Zombs. I feel like Zom's he has a, a scope on that thing. He's got a classic. He's got time. What he doesn't have is friends. Alone here. Trying to work his way around the map. That should give a decent idea of where Zombs is going to be coming from. Drops down. This is not going to be to take away. Spots one player, Thief with the Frenzy. Yet again, a 3k for him. The pistols are so good. Seeing to see them all really hunker down on site proper. Not oh. paying off for a retake. They're up close and personal. Shazam with the classic showing exactly why he wants to do that. Dapper was good for one as well. 
Great. Dancing around the screen. Stellar's the one who gets that last shot, and it's Tens left alone. He's got some utility, but that's all he has. He drops round in favor of Luminosity at hold, and that's yeah. why you see that play out. Look at all, all of the space they've taken away, too. They're deep into the defender's spawn, but Tens holds it off. He pushes what? his way through. Nobody puts Tens in a corner. Not at all. Also, don't line up when you're on tens. Almost looking like a collat there as he picks up two. The entirety of the team, four strong, coming out of defender spawn. And it's going to be tough. Stellar doing a good job of putting up some D. There's another one. We're almost seeing the collats everywhere this round. And sick and tens. Lock it up as the defuse is already going down by Shazam. Quick fingers. He saw that Oprota was starting to rotate out. He's going back to his position to ramp now. Might be able to catch wow. Raze. Tens actually gets into sight. Showstopper's out. Fires it high, and he's going to get the high ground on that one. Coming out Dapper a little too quick in the sight, thinking it's clear. Oprota coming up huge as he takes paint shells during the fight. And it's 92 HP sick. A little bit of armor there as it's just falling off his body. And there's a, there's a lot of low HP on this side. Does he get the shot? He does get the trade, but the round goes. That gets stuck instantly. Tens is still alive on top of the ramps. He has to back up. Thief takes care of him. It's a 4v4. What a way to start the round. I don't... They've only gone A a few times. This is now finally working out for him. As they were able to get Chance, Shazam able to get Tens. The pressure they created here was great. Moose just kind of throwing himself into the fire. But that, it, it could have worked. And it almost didn't because they haven't been A enough to know where the precedence is of where people might be playing. So I like the fact that they were still able to just use that chaos to get through this on the side of LG. Now they've taken B. Uh, as they rotate around, coming from the top, dropping down. Sick trying to do what he can from the back of the site, but it's not going to work. An extra 300 in the bank for the team as that spike goes. As you mentioned, with a one-round lead here in the second half. Ten, nice shot from Shazam. Ten swings, the spike goes down. They get the damage done. Yeah, baby, Shazam gets another one as well. Luminosity down to two. And now... It, this is a great time for Shazam to start opting. He has not been doing it throughout much of the match. He can start to set this precedent <laughs> that he's going to be changing position, controlling the map. This slows down LG even more. And look at the pressure that Sentinels is putting on a flawless round on round 20 as we move in around with some utility. And now they're just finally breaking through. And sick it is. A great crossfire with Dapper. One coming in. I'm not sure how that missed, but six able to trade one back. A flawless through. Another flawless. Flawless. Sentinels is online. Oh boy. They're stop moving, oh. blasting across. The wall goes up, attends an anchor, gets another one with the nades. Yeah, he drops a great res. From Stellar, though, it looks like they want to commit, Riff. They want to go to B. Oh, my God. The Tens, Nade, and Six slow combo was disgusting. They are just shutting down. They are inside the head of Luminosity Gaming here. Let's see if they can keep it up. LG in a decent spot. An opt to fall straight down would not be in favor of Shazam, and he's just going to look to pepper a few bullets into that hell area. This is probably going to be a save here for them as it's a pretty good econ for them to bring into the next round. Zombs coming around slowly for spawn for a few more exits as if one if one of these goes through there's a chance There's a push, but this may not happen Zombs also keep keep an eye on him him unchecked Oof. All right hop offline at this point the rest ready you can see the omen getting into position here as your boy Dre sets this up And Shazam ready in the back of the site. They have to get in they have to take him out He gets two looking for a third. Here's the judge and he's gonna find moose as he lays down the verdict get out of here what else is he going to be able to do? That's too long of a range for the judge. And your boy Dre is finally able to stop him. Choosing which to no. peek. What a disgusting choice there. There's only so much he could do as Dapper and the rest. The, everything we've seen from B Heaven has been noise before any of that action happens. So Stellar with a lot of confidence to just hold that angle. Getting the best of them. And Dapper is going to be able to drop Dre as he throws out the smoke. 3v2 here. Who's going to be able to get the advantage in overtime? Spike is being planted currently by Dapper as they set up a little bit of defense here. The retake looks decent. Wow. They don't have too much destruction utility, but they do have a lot of that intel that they can use, and it helps. Yeah, the retake just went from decent to, I mean, almost, almost, <laughs> imp almost impossible oh. to mess up. And they know exactly where. To, well, they're not. All right, he's taken out. Stellar gets big three play there from LG, and they're doing it again where they're coming in as a team to take these off to make sure that it's not Sentinels securing these rounds. We'll see what happens. 
It's a real long round and a little bit shorter maybe because Sick comes up very quick with a kill there. Throws up wall instantly at A. As you saw, Sentinel's trying to grab info at A immediately for the quick rotation back. With that death, it looks like the committal is towards B. Oh boy. Ends. Ends not able to do any damage. Dapper gets one, but Seller trades that's, it out. The heal's going to come out as well. They're going to get on to B. The wall's going to go up, and that should be... That should be plenty! But Sentinel's here looking to put Luminosity away Cases. at a numbers Spike disadvantage. Places. Sick slowly creeping his way across as the spike goes down. Luminosity with control. Sick has to go aggressive. A Proto's clean shots are there and it all falls onto the shoulders of Zoms. To avoid ice spots, to avoid map three, to try to get us to a second round of overtime. Fake Telly into his smoke to keep Luminosity guessing. The blind fire through that. Zombie continues to creep across a proto. Draw some more attention away from A, but that's exactly where they yep. want to go. Zoms is going to be the first one there trying to play contact, trying to keep Luminosity back. I love the consideration. Just a small choice of utility usage on the way in. Yeah. We saw Proto run over that spike. It was picked up by Moose. He planted it. So they can now get his cooldowns up and running. Dapper goes down to a Proto as they're trying to get back into the site to make it happen here. Tens with a nice shot on the frenzy as Shazam also picks one up. They're running forward, but here's Steve picking the pockets left and right as he comes around from the flank. Beautifully done. Arden. Ooh, that's nice. not what he wanted. Just getting the coattails of Shazam, and that's actually a huge drop there. That was supposed to be him alive for the next few seconds, gaining yeah. intel, giving it out, and making the first play to dash out. So now LG has a lot more that they can work with here. Nice job. Sentinel's pushing even more to get these trade kills out, but it's just the aim from LG able to... And right. they're going to be setting up defense. So you've got to be careful if you're Luminosity. Tens is one point away from his Empress, and he's one of the few that had a rifle going into this round. So this, this round is not won by any means for Luminosity. They're assuming post plants. Zoms has a little bit of utility. I don't, I don't think he's going to be able to upgrade his gun, but you've got to keep an eye on the flank for Moose. Yep, it wasn't Moose. It was actually Dre who took care of Tens. Drops things down to a 1v3. Dom's looking for the last one. Moose takes care of him. It looked dicey, but Luminosity was blank. And it's really just a 2-2. Two and 1-2 two. Yeah. and two in the site, 2 off. Nice trade across. We might see that spike coming back right now, but that also could be them working off the spike. Sentinel sees that. They feel like they're going to have to put all their pressure over towards A, and this one works That's out info. very nicely for LG. Oh, that's info! Look at how they're pulling off! They know where that res is coming from, so they think, okay, the res is there, Sage is over there, that might be where the play is. Meanwhile, they leave one on B, they hear the spike go down, and now they're scattering to get back to where the play is. Luminosity play this so well, Sick has no idea! Sentinels gets caught, Shazam drops as well, Dapper, looking to equalize things. He and Zom's left alone in this 2v3, much like we saw just a few moments ago, post plants. For Luminosity, as the clock continues to tick away. Zom's on the tap, steps right off, and there's the Hunter's Fury that gives him back. Just trying to buy time, right? Stellar good for one, Stellar good for two. The round in favor of Luminosity, and what a beautiful enough to get the ult orb. And now he has an option on whether or not he wants to go in. Luminosity sticking it to him as they shove it down their throats. Proto gets on to Shazam, the wall's gonna go up. Oh, baby. oh but sick with the Bucky! Holy cow! Psalms is good for one as well! It's just Dapper that's left alone against Moose in a 1v1! He's got some utility and he's got a rifle as well. Dapper not nearly as fortunate. And the biggest problem here, Riv, is that the spike is not in the hands of Moose. He can do it. Oh, the look away! The hesitation on that position for just a moment. And it's going to be 100 to 18 HP here. He does have two shock darts. Just chuck them in the air. Yeah. Play the floater darts. Yep. 300 for the plant. 30 seconds left. He's trying to throw a dart out there for a quick second, but doesn't have it for another 10 seconds. And he plays the kitchen. How is Dapper going to realize this? Does he actually go for the high ground right away and put himself up on Snowpile there? What a play by Moose. The ring around the Rosie, but he may not expect it. It's Dapper yeah. already crossed into the site. And I don't know that, Riv, I don't know that he has... I, I think he, he's going to have to reposition from there. To it creates a really to poor angle happen. when he starts diffusing, you're right. Yeah. So Moose here is going to have to... All right, there's the tap. 
It's letting it get to half. Oh no. Yeah, I don't know that he can do it no! from there. Dapper like a thief in the night. And Dapper's just one point away from his. Have an operator in hand as well. And well, why operator? Why ultimate? <laughs> when you've got <laughs> ten. Ooh, is that a leg? She didn't come up there. They were able to finally take down Thief. Ten's coming up with two big ones. The Reyna. He's feeling pretty good on it before he goes down in this round. Round six. Two of LG now pushing in as far as they can. Moose and Dre open. Dre's had quite the series, but this is going to be a tough call. Nice start out. Stick gets a little bit of high coming in. Your boy Dre's going to know that's happening, but one, nice. two. of the map. They take and belong a proto. A proto, though, a proto. Big there for one, but Dapper trades it out. Takes the armor off as well of Dapper. There's going to be a res there. And quickly farming that orb to make sure they can get right back to a red situation as well. Thief's just hanging out. I'm sorry, Six just hanging out. He has ultimate back there. And he's going to start using it. One tag. That's going to be a double. Takes down the spike. The third one's going to go wide, but he's just trying to get it out so he can get back into the action. Zombs drops Thief. And with LG not having sight control yet, they're still looking to push, for push forward a little too early without intel on the center. It's costing them big time. Sentinels comes flying in Spidey style there. Ten picks another one up is sick. Move before the team really activates on the entry. It's going to be one, but he's not able no to way. get it. His ten turns around at the perfect time. You got to be kidding me. Oh, man. And the ultimate set. It's the ultimate that Luminosity had. The tools at their disposal to make something happen here are gone. What? Cheeky the dark there that gave away the aggression from Sentinels a couple of rounds ago, but you've seen really since then, Shazam's not up to any of that. This time it was actually tens, a bit of a different flavor, but the outcome was the same as Luminosity takes care of it. You see a Proto using Showstopper trying to get deep into the belly of the beast, but Shazam with the op takes care of him. Zoms does as well. As things drop to a 3v3, there's the rest from Stellar bringing a Proto back. Moose with three on the round, the op in hand as well. Dapper is left alone. Now, planted. he does have the res, but you wonder at this point, Riv, like, do you, do you even go for it? Is it, is it even worthwhile? <laughs> No, I mean, if if it was down to like almost overtime. <gasps> no. What? No. Dad, what? Good for oh, two. he almost okay. actually gets it. Moose picks up the 4K, but that is uh two Ks. Yes. I mean, you just walk away from that confident aim, right? Dapper, nicely oh, done. Wow. Battle Sage from B. And he's gonna try to give a little bit more pressure here to everybody coming in through mid, as that's the retake they like to play. They'll let mid open. They feel like these long ranges favor them. Up and down. Who's gonna get the shot first? And that's Dapper finally going down. In the site though, and this is a full committal. Everybody's gonna be in. One person that's gonna be on the flank. That's Moose. He is ready. And there the plant starts to go down. It's gonna be the Empress that comes up for 10. He gets slight overheal on. 130 for him as he stays in the site to try and do more damage. Sam with the op looking for him, gives him a haircut, but no damage was dealt as the spike continues to tick away. You see Sick is just kind of playing around the flank, making sure there's nobody coming around. The Lear comes through, tens once again, good for another one as the Empress mm. continues to cause problems. That's three on the round. He's going to drop at the hands of Thief, and now it's on Shazam with that op to try to make something happen. Tens comes back. Dapper and Zom drop. Stellar goes huge. Stellar goes huge, but Sick. Six keeping it at bay himself, but now Stellar's left alone. He doesn't have much as far as gun goes, but it's enough to oh, stop it. Wait a minute! Stellar good for three. He's got a shortly behind that uh, is tens. He's got the frenzy, and he's got a oh. kill. Man, all up in Moose's face, and he's getting a jumping one as well on the thief. I said this the first time I called tens. This is his world, and we're just living in it. He's got four. He's going hunting for the ace. Let him off the leash. He's digging it. 20 seconds into the ride. Basically here for, for Luminosity. They have rifles. They're rotating over to A. And and much like I said earlier in the series, where this is where Luminosity shined, was in retakes because of things like that. A proto's already yeah. good for two. Shazam trades it out. And you see Sentinels. They're playing back off site. Sick has to stay alive here. And you see him understanding that. Playing notably further back. Shazam is there as well. Just two members left on the side of Sentinels. Uh-oh. Happy's on the bomb. Spike could get the fuse here. He's gonna hold it. They're gonna get it. Oh no my god, it was just before I cut the fuse! You have to be absolutely kidding me! They're gonna be able to pick this round up! Wow. No way!
gonna limp their way into this final round. And well, while that's a good start, again, the, the oh my gosh, the adversity that they that they're facing here, the the monumental mountain that they have to climb, yep. might prove to be too much. And and look, even if they get this round, Riv, you have to play perfect Valorant the rest of the way just to get to overtime. Oh, that's good damage. Five HP for Zoms. It's gonna be tough. Spike is still all the way at the back. They haven't really committed just yet. Sentinel's trying to figure out if they can get a few frags here and there and make it work. And this is the round that semi starts to work in favor of LG. We see a lot of their success coming once they they have a direction. Once that spike is planted or they're pinching, they have an idea of where the members are. Their 1v1s aren't going in their favor found in the middle of the map. And it seems to be where their play style falls apart just a little bit here. Only 30 seconds in. And LG, they're going to have to put up some strong defense over here Look at, at the Ace, Look at Ace Spike site. God, Tens Tens gets all the way in. That's the thing. He's taking so much ground when he does. He'll find one to two. Boy, Dre coming up huge there with a few of his sick transfers back onto that. They get Shazam back into the game now. And it is still match point here. Series point for Sentinels as the Spike goes down on A site. Both. The 3v3 kill. thief, good for the first one with the bulldog, as he takes care of Dapper. But again, great position from Sentinels in their post plants, where they can just do so from safety, much like we saw last time. Thief, good for one, but Sick once again left alone in a 1v2. Shock darts there, no way. Sick gets it. Down to a 1v1, Stellar's trying to stick it. I don't know that he even got it to half, but Stellar takes care of him. We're gonna live oh, to fight another word. day. Let's go, Doug, for Sentinels. We may see a slow round here, but a possible victory for them. Shazam gets that operator. It's how they've been getting their wins before. You mm -hmm. pick apart LG ever so slowly, and then you win in the site. Right, and then if that doesn't work, you just send Reyna just to freaking <laughs> run at him. Right? Not speed. If it has to be perfect Valorant, you can't afford a single mistake for them to have gotten as far as they have already is impressive but this might be the straw that breaks the camel's back a proto trading out tens the spike fortunately for lg nowhere really near a position of power and a proto's in a great spot here at least to get a kill no he's not even good for one he has to back up and now they know where he is they're gonna challenge him a proto drops sentinels excuse me luminosity just down to two thief uses that empress he's alone and they have to they have to split the resources they can't afford to give up a site alone four is a crowd for sentinels here they're keeping everybody together and you can always see them checking their six it's just one thing you have to do when you have compositions like this with no traps or kj turret 45 seconds here on the round and like i said a little bit slower here yeah a few frags already but the middle is going to take some time a quick spam down to the wall they know that person is reloading they don't know it's stellar just yet. Thief's on the way over, and they're going to have to have some damn good teamwork here to make sure they keep themselves in the game. Sentinels pressuring match point. Yeah, and then look at Zoms, right? Like, even if things go sideways and they somehow are able to get it,